Hi, if you don't know me, my name is Takuzo Ganre. I graduated high school with straight A stars in maths, biology, and chemistry. And this is the video on how I got an A star for biology. Okay, so biology is just it's one of those subjects where it's not difficult, but it's not fun. That's for me personally. At the time that I started A levels, I didn't know that I was a numbers person. So I really didn't enjoy my biology, but I did it because I wanted to become a neurosurgeon and you know, I thought you needed biology. So it made sense for me to do biology at A level. I didn't enjoy spending time reading and memorizing the large amounts of content that you had to for biology. And if you're wondering why I didn't change, it's because I, I realized that at the end of 2021, which is when I was finishing my AS level, with like biology isn't for me so it was a bit too late for me to change and pick up say something like physics which is something i wish i had actually done the resources that i use for biology for notes i use save my exams and then i use pmt as well and then there's this channel there's this channel on youtube that covers specifically cambridge biology content i think it's called dr demi i found the videos quite useful and then i also use the mary jones textbook i also use snap revise it's a different syllabus but the underlying concepts were the same so for example if i wanted to learn about biological molecules i could just go on and say biological molecules and snap revise actually have a good video on biological molecules even though it's not the same exam board the content in there is still relevant to our syllabus so i was able to actually learn from snap revise yeah for the most part it was just using the save my exams notes that i had and i created loads of flashcards because biology is content and a lot of it had to be memorized you'd have six seven eight more questions that required a lot of information and so you had to know a lot and to to memorize content I used flashcards I used Anki which is an overcomplicated flashcard system I mean you could just make physical flashcards but I was extra so I preferred to do that if you want a tutorial on Anki comment down below and I'll teach you how Anki works so I used that and it actually worked quite well for me so I memorized a large amount of the content for A2 I used Anki for like the first four topics then for the rest of them I like I just gave up I mean most of them were like a repetition of stuff that we had done at all levels so I still remembered most of the concepts and I was pretty comfortable with it so I didn't have to do as much and I was banking on the fact that I would totalize like 50% of the paper and then I'd get at the very least get 30% of the other half which is already 80% and biology is that one subject where I wasn't really like aiming to get like a high 90 grade I was aiming for the 90s at AS level I had 89 so i was aiming to just bump it up slightly to around 1991 i wasn't really aiming high because i didn't enjoy biology the practical exam for biology was absolute chaos the following section is not academic advice this is just my experience so take this with a grain of salt so if you're doing biology you know that there's a microscope section you're viewing the slide through the lens you have like um I think the first one is like a rough diagram at a magnification of like times 10 and then th the second diagram is a detailed diagram at times 40. So for the exam when I was switching my lens to the times 40 lens for some reason the slide was very close so when I switched to times 40 the lens was literally in contact with the slide so I couldn't see anything and if I lowered the slide I couldn't see anything as well but I pretty much just drew from my theoretical understanding of what I was supposed to draw so for practicals that was actually something that I did quite a lot most of the practicals wouldn't work out so I just give the results based on what I would expect using my understanding of the theory behind the practical and so yeah I was just cooking results and I know many of you cook results so <laughs> take this from a straight A star student sometimes the practical just isn't gonna work so you're going to need to understand the theory behind the practical if you want to then do it. I remember there's a time where I literally didn't do the practical but I still managed to totalize the practical because of theory yeah biology is content a lot of content if you like reading go for it if you don't like reading don't do it